I've always had a very deep love for the guitar. I think from the very first time I, I saw one or heard one. Building guitars for me gives me the opportunity for, for a lot of exploration. You need a ton of patience. You know, there's so many facets, especially to an electric guitar. Yeah, it's definitely a meticulous art. Really, every stage of building a guitar, all of those stages share similarities. It is quite a special thing at, at the start, though, to make the first cut on a piece of timber. You know, to true it up so that the edges of the body that you're about to glue will, will meet perfectly. I think the most natural thing for me is to, to create something from the raw materials. I like a lot of parts of the process, but to be actually shaping something that's going to be picked up and held and played and shaping it just from a raw block of wood with just a, a sharpened hand tool is a really special thing. And as soon as I get that spoke shave or a file into my hand, I don't really have to process things too much. When you're building something so complex as, as a modern guitar, there are just so many places where it doesn't take much to make a mistake. So uh, a zen-like focus is not a bad thing. I think the hallmark of a custom instrument is that the maker is often having to stretch so that the player can have something that that reflects their personality and to bring that out means adapting yourself at, at every turn. The more joints and glue and stuff that you put on a guitar, the more of the, you know, the sustain and the character of the instrument is lost. Really, the, the way I build guitars is to construct them in, in the most honest way possible. And since I make so many instruments where I'm really highlighting the natural beauty of the wood, there's almost like a purity to them. There's nowhere to hide the faults. There are a few key elements that make a great guitar. Selecting great hardware and materials is a great start as well as the quality of the machining that's done, the fit of the components together. What has a huge impact on, on a guitar really is the pickup selection. Being that I also make custom pickups for the guitars, you know, I can have a huge degree of control over that. People come to me with requests for custom guitars in many different ways. You know, some people will be very definite about the aesthetics of the guitar and what they want it to look like. Other people will come to me and, and their focus is around the playability of it. They almost know down to the micron what size stainless frets they want on the guitar. Other people, they want something that really fits their physiology like a glove, so the contouring around the body is really important. And the, the bottom line really is that people who want a special instrument can come to me with their ideas in any level of formation and, and I can help them and guide them um, towards having something really special. Building guitars gives me an ongoing scope to scratch my own itch as a guitar lover and just keep producing things that are memorable. The first time you string up an instrument after, you know, what is 
often well over 100 hours of, of labour is, you know, it never stops being euphoric. Often that's kind of the catalyst for the late nights. If I even get an inkling that I can put those few final touches on and get a sound out of a guitar, well, unfortunately the neighbours are going to be up listening to it for a few hours into the night. The time that I have to do this in this life, I want to produce things that bring the most joy and um, are as uh, unique and well thought out as possible.